All right, so I've decided to go ahead and start work on my back plate. Um, I'm going to do it slightly different this time. And if I'm going to for one thing, I'm going to make it lighter. My front plate is like over just a hair over an inch thick and weighs a sh a j about eight pounds. It's heavy. I'm going to make this one lighter. And if I like this one, then I'm going to go ahead and remake a new front plate. And I'll use my old plate that I've got. Uh, as target practice, just to test it out, uh, see how well it stands up to multiple hits. But So what I'm doing this time is I'm going to make maybe about 40 layers behind the ceramic. And this time, instead of a whole bunch of individual sheets cut to shape and size like this, I'm doing it width-wise, so the whole width of this I can get three at a time. And what I do... Just do it this way. See that? There's that, that. And then I'm just going to fold it into threes. And so every three panels is going to be folded. And I believe that the fold and then bound together with resin, this thing will uh, maybe even hold the bit together a little better. Well, will hold together better than a whole bunch of individual sheets would. But here we go. And, uh, I've currently got 20, 22 layers made up, and I just need to make a few more rows of these until I get up to about uh, 40, 40 to 44 layers, I think. Maybe a little less. We'll see. But uh, I definitely want to get up to about 40 um, before I call it quits and then uh, form the plate and then add the tiles and finish it off. This time I will cover this thing, I think, with either Cordura or a uh, nice green or camouflage ripstop nylon.